guys, before we get into this vlog, I wanted to say this was filmed like two weeks ago. We have the New York vlogs coming soon. Um, I'm a little bit behind on vlogs right now. I didn't want to jump on here before this video went up because I didn't want it to come off as like tone deaf because I talk so much about how I love Texas throughout it. I do love Texas. Texas is my home. It's where my family lives. It's where I was raised. It's where my favorite people in the world live. My best friends in the world live. There's so many amazing things about this place. With that being said, um, obviously, like, abortion and women's rights and Roe v. Wade, like, all of that happening right now is absolutely horrible. So we will be donating 10% of profits for the Okind up until Saturday to fund Texas Choice. So you can buy literally anything on the Okind and 10% will go to it. I wish we can give more. The Ryan set drops tomorrow at 10 a.m. Central. If you want an early access code, we're also putting it in the Geneva chat. So anyways, if you've been wanting to buy something from the Okind, just know that until Saturday, 10% of the proceeds are going to find a Texas choice. I don't want to like be a Debbie Downer on this video. Everyone's coming here for an escape. So anyways, we're moving in or moving on. I just didn't want this video um, to come off like a certain way when you know what I mean. Anyways, I love you guys. Um, and let's get into the video. This is the best time ever in Fort Worth. I love Hotel Drover. Incredible. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome to another vlog. Just made it to Fort Worth. Hotel Drover invited us out, which is literally my dream. Also right here, that's for my eye patch. Um, <laughs> stop talking about it. Brow Wedding Housewife merch is going live in like less than an hour. I'm gonna give y'all a little hotel tour. Today's Thursday. Um, I'm here with Hotel Drover in Fort Worth until tomorrow. Just like a quick little like day trip basically. Fort Worth is only you know, like an hour away from Dallas and they don't come enough and it is one of my favorite places in the entire world and I only recently realized that. So I'm gonna give you all a little hotel tour because it is absolutely stunning here. Here's the front door. Oh my God, kicked off my boots. I mean, this is perfect for me. Over here, cute, cute, cute. Love the art that my camera's not focusing on. Over here, here's my mother. Um, So I'm trying to give you all like a really good tour, but my the lens is not wide at all. You open this, you have your robes. My mom's stuff, a Keurig, which like I love Keurigs, and also I love donut shop um, K-Cups. Beautiful mugs, like all of this is so cool. Stuff for wine. Over here is the bathroom. The shower is beautiful, it's so big. Um, I love the sink, honestly, like I love this look. And then over here, more art, and then this wallpaper that I'm obsessed with. I said on my TikTok that when I have a son in like 10 years, this will be what's in his room. So bathroom. Then you walk over here. You might be like, Kenzie, why do you have so much luggage? I'm going to New York straight from here tomorrow, so like ignore that. And also part of it's my mom's, but most of it is mine. Okay, walking over here, we have um, two beds, cute artwork. I haven't even opened this yet. We'll do that in a second. Um, it's just like so many stunning touches, okay? Over here, some horse art, pr art, prints, art. Why can I not talk today? Um, you go out here, a view of the pool. I mean, the building itself is beautiful. We're in the middle of the stockyards. It's the best location ever. And we have, I think we have a cabana by the pool today and bottle service. Ready to get wild, mom? I am. She's taking photos of the, she's an interior designer, so this is kind of her vibe. Um, but yeah, I like, just am obsessed with this. Oh, and you have like a little take, <laughs> They think of everything here. It's so cute. All right, y'all. So I'm going to open up this Hotel Drover Fort Worth Stockyards. I mean, this is a dream. Okay, cute. Says, Dear Miss Piper and Miss Piper Bar. That's my mother's name. It's our pleasure to welcome you to the award winning Hotel Drover and Autograph Collection Hotel by Marriott. Oh, oops. Aw, cute. <gasps> it's the vice president, general manager. Wow. Welcome back to guys. Fancy, fancy. Um, not just for cowboys, located in the heart. Oh, cute. Little pamphlet here. Also, by the way, this is all reclaimed wood. Was that what it was? Yeah, from the stockyards. Esther, our new friend here, was telling us, though, like, from the stockyards, what this was here before. Um, this is only a year old. Everything is, like, reclaimed. I guess there. this was, like, the stables, is what they said. Yeah, and They're nothing, reclaimed. yeah, because next door there's more stables. There's a few. Um, or not next door, but like close. 
Like last time when I came to Fort Worth, which I know I've talked about on YouTube, I just can't believe I grew up so close and didn't appreciate this when I was young in the way that I do now because now this is like completely my vibe and everything that I ever want. However, it is like the cutest town. And it's also, I feel like Fort Worth has grown a lot and there's a lot more here now. We have our itinerary um, and we have- Best fix city with a small town feeling. Yeah, but it's not really, it's still a small. Then opening this. Oh my gosh, guys. <gasps> no way. Okay, we have a little, oh my God, stop. Oh, that, that is, is the cutest so suit I've ever cute. seen in my life. It's from Beach Riot. <gasps> That's adorable. Oh my God. I am like, obsessed with that. So cute. So cute. Okay, well, I didn't bring like shorts to wear so over this. this. I wore like- a, Is this a bathing suit or just it's a, a- It's a- Yeah, it's a it's bathing just suit. A, um, oh, look. Like a body suit. Texas blended whiskey. Cute. God, so cute. Um, love this. Yeah, it's a bathing suit. A little hotel drover. Fort Worth Stockyards tea. Um, a Jackson Vaughn candle. It's the Fort Worth candle. I can't see. Oh, I love that actually. Guys, this is so cute. You know what, when they were explaining this, like I would get married in Fort Worth. I actually think I will probably, but I don't want like a barn wedding. That suit is so cute. No, that is the cutest swimsuit I've ever seen in my entire life. And also it's so hard to find like Western stuff done well, like just like everywhere. Like obviously hotel driver is like perfect, but I mean like, like a DTC product or something. Like a lot of it is like, almost like chuggy, you know? And that is like so cool. It's either really, really cool or like corny, you know? Yeah, yeah. And that is perfect. I'm just in the absolute best mood ever. Guys, wow. Uh, my mom is quite the influencer these days. <laughs> She's getting her Facebook posts together. It's so cute. I cannot get over that swimsuit. Like it I so love cute. it. Guys, I have to just vlog about this suit again because I just can't get over it. It's from Beach Riot. I just found it online. I'll link it below. Um, the one online, it looks a little bit more like white and black, like contrasting. And this one to me is more like nude. But again, like this is the best thing I think I've ever seen in my entire life. It is perfect. Guys, this is the most beautiful, perfect hotel. The most me place ever. Like even the hallways. Let me see if we have time. Hold on. Oh, like down there, all the art. Okay, the art down there was better, but like just trust me. We're heading off right now. Look, even look at this. So cute. We're heading off to the veranda bar right now to meet everyone. I have no idea who's on this trip. Oh my god, it's just so cute. Stay on. The, ho the cowboy motel, like, oh, nope. Those are my cowboy boots. We made it to the veranda bar. So beautiful. They have little bites, cute drinks, beautiful bar. Yeah, it's so cute. Everything is so detailed. It's literally a dream. Like, I could cry. This is my Disney World. It is so cute here. Everything is so detailed and it's just beautiful. Like this is literally my favorite place in the entire world. I'm wearing the one piece. Um, I'm obviously like cover up on. It's not like, okay, like I like when a one piece goes up a little bit higher because it makes your legs look really long. But honestly, it's not too low to where I don't like it. Like I actually like how it fits a lot. The quality is insane. 
Um, and it's really flattering. It really just like, ugh, I love it. It's so cute. Um, yeah, we're going to the pool. I'm currently reading Archer's Voice, I think is the name of the book. I kept seeing it everywhere and people who have similar like reading tastes as me read it and rated it like a six out of five stars. But I read the first page because like the very first page it talks about something weird and it's like not about the book at all. So when I first opened that I was like, no, I'm not even reading the rest of the sample. Went back. I actually really like it. Um, so I'm hoping I finish that book while we're here so then I can start the new one, which is Jane Rosen's new book. Um, these are the things I get so excited about. Also, guys, like, look at how cute this is. Stony Clover gave me a little bag that says books. And look, I have my book in it. And then I think I also have my Kindle. So I need to grab my Kindle right now. Before I get questions, yes, I'm a Kindle reader. This is an early release. They can't send early releases most of the time on Kindle, like until it comes out. So that's why they send those. Anyways, look at my mom in the new pool bag. See, I said in a vlog, I think my last vlog, I'm 24, but um, if I'm at the pool with my mom, she has the pool bag. So that's why I was giving it to you. So here we go. I turned 25 this summer. I'm a homeowner. I moved out when I was 17, but my mother still has the pool bag. But it is really cute. guys yeah it's like a little ranch water station it's so cute we're at the pool now it's so beautiful guys we've made it to the pool it's so beautiful I of course have my kindle i'm in the area that's like kind of deep because it was a better background but it's so beautiful here my swimsuit is so cute um i made a well actually i didn't make it chase made me a ranch water Beautiful. I'm now laying out. I just got this watermelon drink. Looks so good. All right, so good. Some extra chips and guac. So they just gave this to us. I love these chips. Lunch has arrived. We've been out in the pool again. We're splitting a salad and fish tacos. Also, they gave us guac, and it's so good. Everything here is good. The watermelon drink is amazing. Tragic. I'm assuming this is gonna dry. I just did that to myself. All of my stuff is burning up. So I won't be able to read for a second, but it is like so perfect. All right, y'all, we are back from the pool. We just got ready pretty quickly. We were like pretty much the last people to leave the pool. It was actually incredible. Normally when I go for a pool day, I'm the first one to leave and I wasn't even ready to leave when we left. It was really fun. This is my dress. It's the one from Revolve. It's LPA. Super cute. My mom steamed it for me. I am wearing cowboy boots, even though in my last vlog I said I needed to wear heels with it, which I do agree, but I don't know. I was feeling like this. We're going to um, an activation. Uh, is it wide brim or wide and brim? By the way, I read not one single page of my book at the beach. So, the beach, the pool. I had three drinks, so I'm a little bit drunk, I'm not gonna lie. Okay. Hats off to summer at 5 30. We're going to the wide brim and second rodeo brewing. To drink more. Great. Wide brim is in Mule Alley though. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it is. It's for a surprise. So I don't know what we're doing at Wide Brim. They're like the cute hats. So the hats that my mom actually literally always wears. And then um, Second Rodeo is one of my favorite places in Fort Worth. Really cute. It's owned by the same people as Truck Yard. Um, I, I don't remember if I vlogged last time I was in Fort Worth. I'm actually pretty sure I did vlog a weekend in Fort Worth. So we went there then. And then we're going to dinner at 97 West Kitchen and Bar. And then doing like s'mores and stuff outside. It's going to be really hot. We're going in the fire pits tonight. It's going to be tough. I'm not ready for summer in Texas. I'm never ready for summer in Texas. But we're getting ready. We're about to head off. I have my um, Balenciaga bag. I got at the outlets. Best purchase ever. Again, dress LPA. I'll link it below. And then boots are my vintage Harley boots. I can link similars below. I wear them 24 seven, but they were like a Depop find, so they're not like directly linkable, you know? And then I did a very quick little makeup look and that is it. I didn't do my hair at all. I just like took it out of the bun and brushed it. And I'm just gonna like pretend it's supposed to look like this. So that's it. Um, I got a little bit of color, a little bit of a sunburn and I'm feeling good about it. Um, we're heading off. I'm, I only brought this one, this bag and that bag. She wants the pink Balenciaga bag. It is such a cute bag though, right? Mm -hmm. I didn't bring it for once. It's my missed opportunity. I know. It's because, okay, honestly, I've been bringing this bag everywhere recently because it, and I go through phases where I'm obsessed. It carries so much. I got the best deal on the real real. I carry 
literally that print everywhere. I'm so tired of it. Yeah, but I don't, so I love this bag. Anyways. Yeah. Okay, do you want to do an off of the day? Where's um, your dress from? None other than Dawson and Claire. Not written. Are you serious? <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> and then where are the My boots from? My entire wardrobe is Dawson and Claire. It, and they do have a website now. You sound so Texan. Like, not even Texan, Southern by Dawson and Claire. Yeah. Um, what where are the boots from? Are you, those are your Lucasies? These are my Lucasies. Yeah, they're cute. Love, they have a store down below, which I actually want to check out, so we should go. Yeah. I guess when we check out tomorrow though. Where you go for custom things? I know, I do want to get custom boots. They're so expensive, but I'd wear them all the time. Yeah, I know. So like not right now, like that's maybe not my journey today. But like eventually I think I can work that into my journey. Yeah. Well the brown boots that I have, here's the thing. The brown cowboy boots that I have are from Miranda Lambert's line. They are the cheapest boots that I own besides maybe these, but these were Depop. But I wear them all the time. Cheap in price, right? Yeah, like cheap in price. Well, I mean the quality of the other ones is obviously like higher, but that quality is still so good. Yeah. Like they're not, they're still a great quality, but like yeah. obviously when you're paying more, it's higher. But best brown boots, and I wear them all the time over like my more like, not quote designer boots, but like more, more expensive boots basically. So I do want to get a custom pair of brown because the thing about me is that like I get comments about this all the time By the way guys calves, I do have issues with this with boots like they don't they're not as wide around my calves as they want them to be Yeah, you you a yeah custom pair of boots, you So I would your die for them So that's why I want a knee-high custom pair of brown boots and I want a knee-high custom pair of black ones But Danielle the ones that I wore of the Casey's in at stagecoach. I love those too. So we'll see Anyways, um, we actually do need to leave right now because it's 5.22. All right, we're off for the night. The most beautiful place ever. Look. <gasps> I just love it here. We're now at the wide brim in the hotel. Cute. The hats have got a lot of jewelry. Oh, they have the glasses, actually. I must know what they're talking about. This is really cool. Anyways, so cute. It's a second rodeo. Oh yeah, mom. We can have roadies around here. You can literally walk to roadies. You can walk around. Oh yeah. It's a beautiful thing about Fort Worth. Love. Here I am vlogging at the bars again. So much easier to do this when I'm not in Dallas. Cute. Oh my god, it's so great. Like literally the cutest place ever. Cool. Back getting my espresso martini. I, I it just feels more Texas this way. Love an espresso martini live music. I love Texas. Like, there's really no, no place that I would ever love more than this state. I'm having my espresso martini in my flask. Guys, somehow my mom is out joking me. Yeah, she's getting a roadie currently of the espresso martini. We're on, like, she's already the on two. best espresso martini ever. Seriously, cannot stress enough how this is the happiest place in America. Fort Worth, Texas, the stockyard specifically. I love this place, no place like home in Texas. I mean, also, anywhere you can bring a roadie, like I'm into it, you know? But it's just so perfect. Your missed opportunity as a teenager. Oh my God. Riding down the street. Okay, we need to come up a little bit over here. 61 or 62, convertible. This is the back. car she begged her dad for that he wouldn't get her. Like, also, my grandpa's like a car guy, so. Yeah, and the fact Little context. That he his cars are all over the magazines. Stripped, me of this <laughs> stripped you of the opportunity. You would have never, if I asked for that at 16, I, I was gonna, there was no way. I was gonna sing Prince's okay, you're gonna. Red. I wanted it red. Little oh. red Corvette. Yeah, of course. Little red Corvette. <laughs> never happened. I'm so sorry. Stripped. You were stripped of the opportunity. Stripped. If I would have asked you for that at 16, I, you would have laughed in my face. I don't think I would. I think I would have. Fulfilled the dream that I never. Had. You would have lived. You would have never in a if million years. For a 61 or 62 but, program, if was, that but if it was. But if it. But if it was like that I car would. in my time. Well, I mean, if I could have afforded it, I would have done it. Oh wow, that's interesting. I don't think that you would have. My parents are very like work for it. That's it. Like I love my car. Don't get me wrong. It was very cute. I loved my car, but I just don't think that you would have. They're very Texan in that way, guys. So I don't think that they would have done that. But we're going back to the hotel. Um, it's really cute over here. We're really having a great time. For dinner, I really actually, if we have time, I would like to stop in Lucchese. Let's actually stop in here first. Only at my favorite boot store in the whole wide world. Oh, it's closed. It's closed at 7 and it's 7.18. Guys, these boots, first off, those right there, love. The Texas ones, love. 
I love them. We got the ones in the corner. I like guys' boots better. Also, I like the the books right there. I always like the guys' boots better though, because they're like bigger. Guys, just so y'all know, you're probably looking at this thinking, oh, it's mountains. Oh, it's, I don't know, geography. No, it's horses. It's crazy. We made it to dinner at 97 West. So cute. Oh my God, I love it here. There's cards. We have to find our names. Mom, me. more station guys it's just the most perfect place in the entire world Fort Worth Texas mainly hotel drover honestly my mom started watching Nashville for my wreck my favorite show ever if you've seen it you know if you follow my vlogs in 2020 when I was watching Nashville I was an emotional wreck and that's it's like this is us beats all emotional like hangovers from a show ever but Nashville is, you is literally close know the people. they're like they're your people. This, yeah, I've been connection overload. Wait, so you can put Nashville on in the, in the room? What yeah. episode you're I on? Guess if, I guess if I log into my own account, I can figure it out. Yeah, it'll be fine, guys. It's just so perfect and cute, and everything's perfect. Good morning, y'all. Um, just woke up. I'm about to go to I was gonna say Pilates to a yoga class on the lawn. Um, I'm wearing my favorite set from Set Active. I love it so much that I ordered two more in two different colors. But I did, this is a size small for the top, but I normally wear a medium. Oh no, I ordered larges in the tops. Cause I think I need to do larges in the tops. I'll keep you guys posted on sizing. I wear mediums and bottoms and normally mediums and tops and set active. Then I wear the Ryan top from the Okine that launches later this month. So I think I'm gonna make coffee in this little Keurig because this is my favorite coffee, but I just like don't drink hot coffee um, normally like when it's hot out, you know? Anyways, I have like this like dry, well I think I like burned my face with that eye patch. <laughs> and I have these dry patches here. So they like were weird with my soft hammer, but anyways, over here we go. Oh, I guess I can only do it if it's like, I guess like probably, I mean, who cares? I can bring it down. I doubt there's water in here though. Let's see. Okay, yep, yep. I have my coffee. There's no lids, so I'm risking burning myself. And then also, there's no creamer. But you know what? I'm going back to drinking my coffee black. People in Fort Worth, I'm sure, drink their coffee black. And I used to always drink my black. Why did I stop that? That was such a good, healthy habit that I formed. You know, it's different, I think, because I would drink iced coffee. Do any of y'all drink your iced coffee block? I feel like that's a different level. Anyways, last night, we went to dinner at 97 West, which is the restaurant in the Drover. And then we did, like, a little s'mores night after. I, at that point, you guys saw how many drinks we were giving yesterday. There was just so many drinks and so many, like, different liquors. I was like, I cannot put anything else into my body or else it will literally, like, die. Not at, like, a drunkness level, just in, like, a combinations level. So, I did have s'mores, even though I love s'mores. So we had this really cute little outdoor, like, fire pit area. And we did s'mores. They had live music. Live music is truly, like, the key to my heart. That's, like, my favorite thing in the world. So, it's just my dream i keep saying while i'm here like this is literally like my happy place my favorite place in the entire world i would rather be in fort worth than probably like anywhere so anyway um also fort worth versus dallas you can't compare the two separately like i don't know if i could live at fort worth in this sorry in this period of my life yet but like i would maybe get like a lake house over here or something 
but I would compare Fort Worth more to like a very, very, very small town. Like Fort Worth is its own thing, but like it's just like, a, I was gonna say very, very small Nashville, but it's not Nashville. Like it's very Western. It's very like, I, I don't know how to describe it. It's slow, it's older. Like it's just so cool. Dallas and Fort Worth, you can't compare the two cities because they're totally different. They're not similar, honestly, like, really at all. Um, Fort Worth is like very small, even though it's not super small, but like it has a small, slow, smaller time field, whatever. And then Dallas has like pretty much almost everything that you would want. It's very modern, it has everything. Um, yeah, they're just different. But anyways, I love Dallas too, obviously. This is just like my, I like to go to have fun. So once this cools down and I stop talking, I'll, oh, okay, I'm on again. I'm heading downstairs to Pilates, or no, yoga. Hi y'all, welcome to my outfit for yoga this morning. Set active, the ride top from the Oka I'm launching later this month. Made it to yoga this morning, it's so cute. Ready. We went to breakfast. Um, I'm wearing this dress from Princess Polly, my normal bag, my favorite cowboy boots. Just did a little bit of makeup. Where are my hoops? Over here. Okay. This morning, we're going to something in the courtyard right now, and then I think we're doing the cattle drive, and then a little bit of shopping at Mule Alley. I'm flying out to New York tonight, and my mom's going to drop me off at the airport, so we're going to do a little bit of like shopping around um, after we check out at one. This has literally been the best trip. I think this has been my favorite like influencer trip I've done. So much fun, also so perfect. So anyways, dress as Princess Polly, we're off. Thank you so much. All right y'all, we have some champagne. It's so cute here in the courtyard. And then it's Mule Alley, best location. Um, you know guys, I think I need a house in Fort Worth. It's truly a dream. All this stuff over here, champagne. This is the champagne actually too that was dropped off at my house last week from um, Bistro 31 or Lombardi Family Concepts, but 97 West is here. Okay, Z's in there, I need to go in. Maybe get some boots. This is so cute. All right, look at this. Hey, they're here. Danny, look. Their horns are so wide. All right, y'all, we just saw the cattle drive. It was really cool. I've actually never seen it. And now we're in Flea Style. If you're in Fort Worth, you can get like custom hats made, kind of like how we did last night. They're so cute. It's so hot though. I'm dying. See, lots of hats to pick from. Oh my God, it's just like so cute. So like my favorite hats, like obviously Stetson's great, but I like like more of this. My mom likes a wide brim. I like like cowboy hats, but they're so cute. I have one that like, looks just like that. All right, we just finished shop. We have to go back to the hotel to pack up our stuff. I think we're gonna do a little bit of shopping here after. Um, and then I have a flight tonight, so eventually we're going to the airport. But this has been like the best trip ever. Thank you so much to the driver. Um, literally my favorite place in the entire world. Like, just look at how perfect it is. I'll never get over it. I really won't. It's in the stockyards, y'all have to come. Honestly, if you're doing a trip to Texas, I really recommend Fort Worth and the Drover because it's it's like more of what you imagine Texas to be, very Western. Oh my God, they're so cute, so, so cute. Y'all, they even gave a gift for the dogs. So it's a pet friendly hotel. If you come up, they have like a bed in the corner and stuff. We didn't bring the dogs obviously, but little treats and these bandanas. Oh my God, they're so cute, so, so cute. Buy a beautiful, perfect hotel room. I've now changed. I'm in the outfit I'm gonna end up wearing to the airport tonight. We're gonna finish up shopping. Our bags just went down to the car. 
You guys see that slight tan? No, you don't see it, but I see it. <laughs> it's a sunburn. Um, we're gonna do some shopping, and then I'm gonna get to the airport a little bit earlier than the rest of my friends and do some work, I guess, there, but I need a coffee really bad. I love it here. Back at my favorite store, the actual one. We had the custom one earlier. So those black ones up there, I think that's what you have in brown. Danny has those, and the calf's so wide, that's why I love them. But there's just no better boots at all. These are very cool. Oh, I love those. So if you're not a cowboy boot girl, which I can't relate, but these are like so subtle and perfect. And these, if you have a wider calf, to just like throw jeans in, like in the fall, they're just the cutest. I love them. Also, that's the like red ones that I loved. Hey y'all, going in to get coffee, we went into the Casey store, got a little like history lesson. It was so interesting. There's an outlet in El Paso that I'm gonna make a trip to. But I need to get like actual iced coffee so I can have energy. Oh, the babe sign's so cute. We just came into, I think it's Avoca coffee, and I got a New Orleans style coffee, which is my favorite coffee in the entire world. It's my order at Blue Bottle. They have it at Foxtrot now. It's hard. It's kind of rare that you find it. I took one sip, and this might be the best coffee I've ever had. Literally ever. If you are in the stockyards, you've got to come here. It's really close to Lucchese, and oh my, Lucchese, I don't know why I'm saying weird, but amazing. All right, y'all, we're leaving. I'm about to go, actually, we're at the airport right now. I'm about to get dropped off to go to New York for the live show. So I'm gonna end this vlog and start another. We had the best time at Hotel Drover. I cannot recommend it enough. It is my favorite place in the entire world, favorite hotel. Like, it was just the best weekend ever. So thank you so much. I'll link up their site below if you guys like care to book or anything. Incredible, we have so many TikToks too, but hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Love you guys so much, and I will see you in like two minutes. I work my ass off to get yeah. here just for my husband to stand next to me and get acknowledged. <laughs> like, come on. It's not his fault. He feels like terrible about those situations.